Good evening. Thanks for joining us today. We have a first alert update. Wendy County police identify the suspect in a shooting they say was sparked by road rage. Officials say the man who died in a car crash in West Bend is their suspect. He's been identified as 73-year-old Donald M. Lucero of Winnicottie. Police say Lucero shot another driver yesterday afternoon in Winnicottie and left that man critically injured. Tonight, we're hearing from neighbors who say they're shocked about the incident at Lake Winnicottie Park. Emily Riley is live in Winnicottie after speaking with those who live nearby. Emily. Cammy, neighbors here tell me they heard gunshots yesterday afternoon. One even recalled smelling gunpowder. The incident at Lake Winnicani Park Wednesday afternoon, leaving one man critically injured. Police say the shooting was sparked by road rage. The victim drove himself to a nearby dentist's office for help and was taken to the hospital. Officials say the suspect drove off and investigators now confirm he is the person who died in a car crash in West Bend last night after a brief chase with police. Police came by a little later and uh we're asking questions and I still was under the impression it was probably firecrackers and I said well somebody report you know somebody uh, shooting off fireworks he says no somebody was shot I'm going what that surprised me so another neighbor Jason Herman says he was working from home while he heard those same loud noises he says he later received a message from his child's high school about a soft lockdown after that initial thought I, I kind of put it out of my mind but then I saw some detectives and cops walking through my yard <laughs> So I'm like, okay, that's interesting. So then I, you know, put two and two together and figured, okay, the shots or the sound I heard before must have been something more serious. Both neighbors we spoke with today say they're still in disbelief. It just doesn't happen in this town. It's, uh, you know, pretty crime-free town, really. Got a good police department, good pr protection around here. At last check with authorities, the victim of the shooting is still in critical condition. Reporting live in Winnicani, Emily Riley, Action 2 News.